हेलो चिल्ड्रन वेलकम टू योर ऑनलाइन क्लास ऑफ एस एस टी टूडे वी विल डिस्कस लेसन इलेवेंथ ऑफ हिस्ट्री बिल्डिंग्स पेंटिंग्स एंड बुक्स द आयरन पिलर एट मेहरोली देहली इज अ रिमार्केबल एग्जाम्पल ऑफ द स्किल ऑफ इंडियन क्राफ्ट पर्सन इट इज मेड ऑफ आयरन सेवन पॉइंट टू मीटर हाई एंड वेज ओवर थ्री टन्स इट वॉज मेड अबाउट वन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड ईयर्स एगो वी नो द डेट बिकॉज देयर इज एन इंस्क्रिप्शन ऑन द पिलर मैंशनिंग अ रूलर नेम्ड चंद्र हु प्रोबेबली बिलोंग टू द गुप्ता डेनेस्टी द स्किल्स ऑफ अवर क्राफ्ट पर्सन आर ऑल्सो अपेरेंट इन द बिल्डिंग्स दैट हैव सर्वाइव्ड सच एज स्टूपाज द वर्ड स्टूपा मीन्स अ माउंट वाइल देयर आर सेवरल काइंड ऑफ स्टूपाज राउंड एंड टॉल बिग एंड स्मॉल दीज हैव सर्टेन कॉमन फीचर्स जनरली देयर इज अ स्मॉल बॉक्स placed at the center or heart of the stupa this may contain bodily remains such as teeth bone or ashes of the buddha or his followers or things they used as well as precious stones and coins this box known as a relic casket was covered with earth later a layer of mud brick or baked brick was added on top and then the dome like structure was sometimes covered with carved stone slabs often a path known as the pradikshna path was laid around the stupa this was surrounded with railings entrance to the path was through gateways devotees walked around the stupa in a clockwise direction as a mark of devotion both railings and gateways were often decorated with sculpture look here this is amravati this was a place where a magnificent stupa once existed many of the stone carvings for decorating the stupa were made about 2000 years ago some of the earliest hindu temples were also built at this time deities such as vishnu shiva and durga were worshiped in these shrines the most important part of the temple was the room known as the garbhagriha where the image of the chief deity was placed it was here that priests performed religious rituals and devotees offered worship to the deity often as it bitar gaon a tower known as the shikara was built on top of the garbhagriha to mark this out as a sacred place building shikaras required careful planning most temples also had a space known as the mandapa it was a hall where people could assemble some of the finest stone temples were built in mahabalipuram and a hall there were several stages in building a stupa or a temple usually kings or queens decided to build these as it was an expensive affair first good quality stone had to be found and transported to the place that was often carefully chosen 
for the new building. Here, these rough blocks of stone had to be shaped and carved into pillars and panels for walls, floors and ceilings. And then these had to be placed in precisely the right position. When devotees came to visit the temple or the stupa, they often brought gifts which were used to decorate the buildings. For example, an association of ivory workers paid for one of the beautiful gateways at Sanchi. Among the others who paid for decorations were merchants, farmers, garland makers, perfumers and hundreds of men and women who are known only by their names which were inscribed on pillars, railings and walls. Ajanta is a place where several caves were hollowed out of the hills over centuries. Most of these were monasteries for Buddhist monks and some of them were decorated with paintings. As the caves are dark inside, most of these paintings were done in the light of torches. The colors which are vivid even after 1500 years were made of plants and minerals. The artists who created these splendid works of art remain unknown. Some of the best known epics were written during this period. Epics are grand, long compositions about heroic men and women and include stories about goats. A famous Tamil epic, the Sila Padikaram, was composed by a poet named Ilango around 1800 years ago. It is the story of a merchant named Kovalan who lived in Puhar and fell in love with a cottagean named Madhvi, neglecting his wife Kannagi. Later, he and Kannagi left Puhar and went to Madurai where he was wrongly accused of theft by the court dweller of the Pandya king. The king sentenced Kovalan to death. Kannagi, who still loved him, was full of grief and anger at this injustice and destroyed the entire city of Madurai. Another Tamil epic, The Money Maklai, was composed by Satana around 1400 years ago. This describes the story of the daughter of Kavalan and Madhvi. These beautiful compositions were lost to scholars for many centuries till their manuscripts were rediscovered about a hundred years ago. A number of Hindu religious stories that were in circulation earlier were written down around the same time. These include the Puranat, which in Hindi we call Puran. Kehte hain. Puran literally means old. The Puranat contains stories about gods and goddesses such as Vishnu, Shiva, Durga or Parvati. They also contain details on how they were to be worshipped. Besides, there are accounts about the creation of the world and about kings. Two Sanskrit epics, the Mahabharata and Ramayana, had been popular for a very long time. Some of you may be familiar with these stories. Mahabharata is about a war fought between the Korvaj and Pandvaj who were cousins. This was a war to gain control of the throne of the Kuruj and their capital Hastinapur. 
द स्टोरी इट सेल्फ वॉज एन ओल्ड वन बट वॉज रिटर्न डाउन इन द फॉर्म इन विच वी नो इट टूडे अबाउट फिफ्टीन हंड्रेड ईयर्स एगो बोथ द पुराना एंड द महाभारता आर सपोज टू हैव बीन कंपाइल्ड बाय व्यास द रामायणा इज अबाउट रामा अ प्रिंस ऑफ कोसला हु वॉज सेंट इन टू एक्जाइल हिज वाइफ सीता वॉज एबडक्टेड बाय द किंग ऑफ लंका नेम्ड रामना एंड रामा हैड टू फाइट अ बैटल टू गेट हर बैग ही वॉन एंड रिटर्न टू अयोध्या द कैपिटल ऑफ कोसला आफ्टर हिज विक्ट्री लाइक द महाभारता दिस वॉज एन ओल्ड स्टोरी दैट वॉज नाउ रिटर्न डाउन वाल्मीकि इज रिकोगनाइज एज द ओथर ऑफ द संस्कृत रामायण ordinary people also told stories composed poems and songs sang danced and performed plays some of these are preserved in collections of stories such as the jatakas and the panchatantra which were written down around this time this was also the time when aryabhata a mathematician and astronomer wrote a book in sanskrit known as the aryabhatiya he stated that day and night were caused by the rotation of the earth on its axis even though it seems as if the sun is rising and setting every day he developed a scientific explanation for eclipse as well he also found a way of calculating the circumference of a circle which is nearly as accurate as the formula we use today vahramira Brahmagupta and Bhaskaracharya were some other mathematicians and astronomers who made several discoveries so children this lesson has been completed thank you bye bye